Is everything rolling? Yeah. Okay. It's end of 2023, and if you haven't found your favorite sunscreen, what are you doing? Good news is, we have some suggestions for you, because these are our favorite sunscreens of 2023. It's actually more of Belle's show and tell. <laughs> I've tried so many sunscreens this year. So I've distilled it down to these, which I'm gonna share with you guys. And Ro has one. I have one. <laughs> I have a humble Why one. Why don't you share your <laughs> one first? Oh, by the way, before we go into it, we have three other videos, the best ofs for cleanser toner, serums, moisturizer. Now we're in our fourth installment, so we'll link all the previous videos here. And it's the roundup of the week. Yay! So, for my sunscreen, it is Jumi So. They have an awesome, not awesome, but awesome, ah. Airy Fit Sunscreen. SPF 50 PA, probably with, I think, four pluses. It's $22. It is phenomenal. I think of all the sunscreens I've tried this year, definitely not as much as you. I bought a lot of sunscreen actually, but the one that I kept going back to and I keep going back to is this awesome Airy Fit sunscreen from Jimmy. So it holds its form. So it's a lotion? It's more of a lotion, but it's so lightweight. There's zero white cast. It's so nourishing. It gives you a glow without being oily. Mm -hmm. And that's like the best mm -hmm. type of glow from a moisturizer, from a sunscreen. Because a lot of sunscreen claim they give you a glow. And then you're just like, oh, I look like a grease ball. Yes! Doesn't take much work to work it into the skin. The skin feels great. Super nourished, super moisturized. Dewy glow. This year has been a Jumi So year for me. It's for sure my best brand discovery of the year. I wanna try it. I'll send it to you. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. My favorite of the year. What was this? She made me try this yesterday and I was shocked. I put it on my skin and no words. I was blown, like absolutely blown away. And she's like, right? Right? <laughs> <You're> right? <laughs> That's right, you've been missing out. No, but actually, as you work it into your skin, it's like half water bursting, half moisturizer. Yeah. And like, it feels like a moisturizer. Yeah. Guys, I love this little nozzle. It's so good. So this also has a slightly green tint, but it doesn't really come up as anything. Let me just show you what this looks like. So smooth. What I found is really important is that sunscreens might seem really fluid and, you know, creamy or glowy. But the thing is, you have to let your sunscreen sit on your face for at least two to even five minutes to see the actual finish that it gives you. It's and a it's full cooling. Chem yes. 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 It's like a gel lotion. There's calming ingredients like Hortunia cordata, licorice fruit, the centella. So all of it is based around sensitive skin. Even though it's a chemical formulation, it's just beautiful. It gives you skin. After I discovered this, I was like, that's it. Close the book. I don't need to use any sunscreen again. <laughs> Highly recommend. Numbers in, killed it. Yes, <laughs> even for dry skin, this was amazing. Okay, so very similar to this. This is also very close. This is the Anua Hot Leaf Silky Moisture Sun Cream. So Hot Leaf is actually Hortunia Cordata. Ah. And the active ingredient is called Cursetran, and that's what gives you that soothing, Excuse calming. You. <laughs> As in, it sounds like a coughing or something. Cursetran, <laughs> bless you. <laughs> It's a silky moisture sun cream. They don't lie. It's silky moisture. It's like, oh, sorry. It just sinks Whoa. into the skin. It's so cooling again too. <laughs> you want your moisturizer to leave the skin looking like what yes. this leaves you. No, actually, because if you look at this one, it's still a bit, there's it's like a, a glow. Yeah. There's like a soft glow. Yeah. This one, it's not matte. It's not dewy but it's perfect. It's second skin. It's yes. like what you want. So that's what this one is. Wow. And I was like, <laughs> just when I thought I achieved the holy grail, <laughs> found it and then I found another one. It's alcohol free, fragrance free. What you smell is whatever those ingredients <laughs> are. So I have nothing more to say about that. <laughs> so <laughs> moving on to what I think is the best find and formulation for giving your skin 
Second skin, but more balanced. If you're a little bit more oily and you want it like a moisturizer that gives no sheen, but it just looks like skin again, then it's this. This is the Haru Haru Black Rice Moisture Airy Fit Daily Sunscreen. Airy Fit is having a moment. Yeah, it is. When you were saying that, I was like, <laughs> I've heard that before. And it doesn't leave it feeling slippy, slidey on your face. Bing! Favorite. I've actually got like more than two tubes of this. It just gives more flexibility in how much glow. In the summer, I will skip my moisturizer and just go from toner or serum straight into sunscreen and it gives the perfect finish. I'm shocked. <laughs> the <coughs> <laughs> because it's essential oil free, I think that's what makes it so non shiny and non reactive. I think this year was the year I realized <laughs> the more fluid and lightweight, the actually sometimes more glowier it looks, the more lotion, the more skin like. Like nothing overly in your face, which is what I love. And if you've been around for a while, long enough, you know Haru Haru, Wonder. Toner is Fel's absolute favorite that she swears by. Yeah. It's just like very approachable Korean skincare that you can use every day that just works. So now, those are my favorites from the K-Beauty lands. Wait, there's one, sorry. Our thoughts are being so fragmented, oh. but if you guys want the Haru Haru toner with Beauty Within branding on it, it's a special thing that we created. Oh yeah. The Beauty Within shop. We had a collab. My favorite toner. We put our Beauty Within hearts on it, so you can still find that. <laughs> Le Francais. Is this one you got me from yeah. Paris that time? Mm -hmm. So it's probably nearing its end of its life. Keep tabs on oh, yeah. sunscreen expiry because it's very important. It's like vitamin C. The filters are reactive in their own way. I don't know how, but like you have to throw it out. The formula of this is beautiful. If I say fluid, this is what fluid means. It's runny. Oh yeah, so the thing is Caudalie can't sell sunscreen in the US because they use like EU filters. Mm -hmm. So this, I got in Paris and yeah. this you can get in Europe, but then you can't get in the States or I'm sure there are some ways that maybe you can find it, but they just don't sell it as far as like Sephora or Lime. On the website, it said something interesting that it was like, our sunscreens contain filters offering the highest protection of UVA rays, which can stain clothing. And it's best to leave your sun protection to dry before getting dressed. I was like, I've never heard of that. Interesting. Yeah. Oh, that makes sense though. Like if your color starts staining, yeah. maybe it's your sunscreen. I love this fluid texture. And this one is very lightweight, but it does give your skin glow. I don't know. What oh, it's yeah, got. it's definitely a bit more nourishing finish, that glowy finish. Yeah. Our tip when you judge a sunscreen, leave it on for at least 30 minutes to see how it settles, and then check back in one or two hours later to see how your skin reacts with the formula. And then also don't judge the sunscreen based on just the first impression because sometimes they become lighter, sometimes they become thicker, depending on what it is. If you're in Europe, love that. Wow. I don't think you'll be hearing from me from sunscreen <laughs> discoveries. A long time. If you do want more and you want to see four more sunscreens that I tested for the whole week and left on throughout the day, I have a whole video. We'll put all the sunscreen videos here and sunstick videos. And that wraps up sunscreen discoveries of 2023. Yay! Let us know in the comment section below. Were there any surprises? Were there anything that you felt like we left out? What are your personal favorites? Let us know. Let's have a discussion. Sharing is caring. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs> okay. Yay! Yay!